find things and show me things. All I know is one day he took me out of the hospital and took me for a walk in heaven. Wow. We went through like a tunnel when we got through the tunnel. Praise God. There was fire on the other end. See, that? they silenced the hellfire brimstone preaching, but y'all better go back to it. Because hell is for real. Right, right, right. I saw flames leaping up. And I heard people screaming, saying, Jesus. Oh my God. And I had an understanding in here that many of them were pulpit folk, oh evangelist folk, choir members, with unforgiveness in your heart. God has spoken to you and told you to forgive, and you're holding on to it. You can't take that unclean thing into heaven with you. But I don't like anything that's too hot to eat. Too hot to eat. So I went around it. I didn't need to see who was in that. Hallelujah. And then we started on our journey. You may not like this. But we went right on up. We climbed higher and higher. The colors the word like you could never imagine. Oh, what a beautiful place. What a beautiful place. And we got around the bend, and I saw my mother and my mother-in-law standing side by side with their back to me. And I started laughing. You know what they were doing? The most favorite thing in the world. Neither one of them minded cooking. They cooked. Because they're going to eat. <laughs> and when they heard me laughing, they turned around and just looked at me. And just the, the idea of seeing my mother, I went running toward her. And that man I was with called me back and said, come back. Then mm -hmm. we went on a little bit farther up the hill. And I saw bushes everywhere. Wow. But when I got close to the bushes, they were not bushes. They were aborted babies. And see, we don't talk about that in the church. And we back folk that push that. And I had an understanding that God is angry with America. All those bushes out there. There was no room in the building that normally would house these children because there were so many of them. Brothers, we have a job to do. We can't entertain these folks. No, we, can't. we can't make them feel good and they walk out of here and say, my, 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 what a time we've had. What kind of time? And you're not convicted. You're not straightened out. Oh, I forgot I was supposed to be nice. I said to, they were building on the building, and I said to the, the man, I said, can I stay here and help them? And he said, he looked at me and he smiled. And he said, you've helped a lot of people. You come with me. And the song that I remember from youth was, there's peace in the valley. Because there was peace everywhere. Yeah. And what we've forgotten about is the peace of God. We want people to be at peace with us. They can't give you peace because they don't have it. Thank you, God. If you're going to have peace with God, you've got to get that yourself. Yes. Hallelujah. And Jesus said, I am the Prince of Peace. Yes. Yes. Glory to God. heard another song in the garden. The voice I heard is falling on my ear. The Son of God is near. And he falls Hallelujah. Did the bird touch this thing? Because you couldn't hear nothing because he was there. 
And then we see we sing that song, walk around heaven all day. No, you're not. Because <laughs> my mother, my mother-in-law, and I didn't call her mother-in-law. She was mom. Yes. Wow. Her mother was a, my mom. They had a job to do. And my understanding was that they were taking care of some of those babies. And among those babies was some babies out of my own family. Secrets. I'm trying to help somebody in here. Glory to God. Hallelujah. 